we've somehow been in, indoctrinated into this myth that a flat stomach implies a strong core and that it's important for your core to hold that in. And that I think has also impacted men as well as women. Yeah. And, uh, you know, so it's not just a self image in terms of attractiveness, but it's also a self image in terms of our perception of someone who's healthy. Just briefly, you could digress to talk about why a flat stomach is maybe not necessarily the best thing for either your self-image or your or your carriage, if you don't mind. Yeah. Uh, so, so, and I would say women were already struggling with this, and then on top of it, we got the core strength. You know, have to have a flat stomach thing, which then, of course, infects men as well. Um, yeah, and I, I totally, I, I, I totally agree with you. Now, in the, I, I would say I did 40 years of Aikido. You know, you do all of this um, rolling and getting up. You, your core is pretty well educated. I like to think of an educated core rather than a strong core. But you know, you want to be able to do all kinds of things and and use your core and not be over stressing the the periphery and you know my stomach's always been a little round i i feel i feel like i you know i couldn't have really had much stronger of a core when i was a fanatic aikidoist and my stomach was always round so there's there's no contradiction there between having a strong core and having a rounded stomach uh i think it's it's a it's a um it's an infectious idea that is not only destructive but wrong actually. Um, and, you know, that that process of accepting ourselves the way we are, can be so fraught. It was it was this client I'm talking about, it was definitely a process. And I think the Feldenkrais method in general, and the way that you start to experience your breathing, in a lot of different situations, a lot of tricky ways we have to get people breathing more, that where you start to feel the connection between parts, your overall experience of embodiment changes. And that in a sneaky way helps one um, accept oneself more the way they are. That's what I see over and over again. <laughs>